Hey, so what up guys, Matt here with Joy Tech. I need to search to replace my original S10 Plus screen protector which came pre-installed. I tried a lot of China brands along the way and the results haven't been that good. As you can see, I have one China screen protector installed right here. You can see there's bubbles at the edges. It's not bad, it's cheap. It costs only 18 ringgit for two pieces which included the back carbon fiber skin as well. I mean, I'm not going to complain, the price is pretty cheap. But the quality overall, I was really not satisfied because both of the screen protectors which I applied had bubbles at the side. In fact, the first one which I applied had even more bubbles on both sides. This one turned out much better, but still you can see the oleophobic coating isn't that good. The smudges are almost impossible to remove. So, I did my research and came across a screen protector from Rinky. I was a bit skeptical about Rinky screen protectors because I've actually installed one of their screen protectors before which is the Invisible Defender for my Galaxy Note 8 and it was really really hard to install because it was like a sort of a nano screen protector which is like a soft film screen protector so it wasn't the best installation process which I had I mean they gave me all the tools but the screen protector wasn't such of a good quality either and it was very sticky so I read some reviews and I came across this Rinke screen protector so I haven't seen it in person actually so it just came in the mail today and it took about about two weeks because uh, last week was a public holiday so it about took about two weeks to actually arrive at my home so you can see Rinke so it's wrapped in bubble wrap I ordered this from Lazada for around 47 ringgit so it's not too expensive but more expensive than the one I'm currently using here which is uh, pretty much crap and it also comes in a set of two so if you do mess up the first one you also can have a second chance with it okay so before we begin this video if you haven't subscribed to this channel already hit that subscribe button enable notifications so you can get notified on the latest content which I post so without further ado let's get into the package okay so guys so back you can see I've actually upgraded my sort of a studio lighting I got these two lights so you can make the white balance a lot easier for the camera. Okay, so let's take out the screen protector from the packaging. So okay, the screen protector is right here. So you can see this is the dual easy film. So okay, let's take a look at the packaging. You can see Rinky. I've used the cases in the past and I can see the cases are pretty good. I mean for the price, there's nothing to complain. Slightly more than the average China made case. But it is, this is, of course, Korean. So what do you expect? You ship it all the way from Korea. Okay, let's take a look at the package. You can see Rinke Dual Easy Film. You can see for the Galaxy S10 Plus right here. See, self-dust remove. You can see self-dust removal, easy application, and full coverage. So I'm interested to try that out. I heard the oleophobic coating on this one is good as well. You can see Rinke Dual Easy Film. Same thing on the back. You can see instructions on how to install. So this thing is unique because it also has a de-dusting film inbuilt into the screen protector itself. So it's pretty cool. I mean, it's a step that is really needed and they've integrated it right into the installation process. So you don't have to have, you know, dust removal tools and stuff like that. So you can just install it straight away. Of course, you must use the alcohol prep pad to clean off the screen and the, all the oil to make sure the installation process goes well. Okay. So let me take out my phone from this case. You can see this is an Autobox symmetric case. You can check out my video. I'll link it in the description. So let me take the phone out of this case. I put that case to the side. You can see I have a transparent common fiber skin as well. From the package I got with this screen protector, as you can see. So I'm going to remove this screen protector. But before that, let's open this packaging and see what it comes with. So you can see they even have a link for you to watch the install video but I'm not going to do that okay let's see what it comes in the package you can see some stuff dropped out already okay nothing else let's put that to the side okay so first things first the stuff that dropped out so you can see Rinky screen lens and cleaning wipe which is actually just alcohol prep pad next you get is a nice squeegee with a microfiber tip so that will prevent getting scratches on your newly installed screen protector Okay, that's next. You get a pretty nice microfiber cloth. Okay, so let's put that to the side. You can see they have installation guide as well. 
step one, step two, step three, and step four. So you can see this is all in Korean. Uh, the English version, I guess, is on the box itself. Okay, so you get two screen protectors here. You see? Hopefully the process goes well. I mean, this is my first time, or should I say my second time trying a ring case screen protector. So I hope this time it goes well. Okay, so I'm going to shift the camera to another angle and show you how the installation process goes. Okay, so guys, we're at the last stage of this video, which is actually the installation process. So I'll fast forward the portion of this video so that you can see me install the screen protector yet it won't consume too much time because it's basically cleaning the screen with the alcohol prep pad, wiping down with a microfiber cloth, and then installing the screen protector. So I hope I have to use one only because I don't want to risk with the second try because I want to keep this as a spare. So let's get into the installation. Okay guys, so I finally got this screen protector installed and I tell you the process was super simple. I've never installed a screen protector this easy in my life, not even a glass screen protector. Of course, glass, glass screen protectors in general are quite easy to install, but this is the next level easy to install. Anyone could do it, even an amateur or first timer could do this. But of course, I recommend you watching the video to actually see the steps on how to install a screen protector. That will help a lot. Okay, so... Let me show you that the ultrasonic fingerprint scanner actually works with this screen protector, so you can see. But of course, it's not with face recognition. Okay, let me show you without facial recognition, so you can see. So simple, so easy, it works, even with the tap. The previous screen protector, which I used, the China one, it was basically crap. When I first installed it, it worked, but as soon as it got smudged and the olifobic coating was gone, I could almost like forget about using the in display fingerprint scanner because it wouldn't work at all you can see this is excellent this screen protector i'm really impressed with it i mean like this is 47 ringgit well spent and i can assure you that if, even if you install this screen protector on any other device i mean of course a compatible one like the s10e the s10 itself and s10 plus or even the huawei p30 pro in fact they have this screen protector for a lot of curved screen phones I think even the iPhone, if I'm not mistaken, you can find all of this in Lazada. I can show you that this product is really something I would highly recommend. And especially the oleophobic coating is super smooth, it's super nice. I mean, the feel is really good. You can see me wiping off these smudges so easy, just with a microfiber cloth. You can see this back to new. Okay, so that about wraps up our Rinke Dual Easy Film Screen Protector. I can show you that this is a product I'll definitely recommend because this product is awesome. I mean, I would totally get it for all my future devices. So simple, so easy. I'm still amazed at how simple the installation process was. You can see no fancy dust removal stickers, positioning tapes, no such thing. Just a squeegee, a microfiber cloth, an alcohol prep pad. I wish they included two alcohol wipes because there's two pieces of screen protector inside. But oh well, this is easy, pretty easy to get. You can get this anywhere, even at a pharmacy. So it's not too bad. I have a ton of them. So that wraps up this video for this week. If you're looking for the best screen protector, of course not the tempered glass screen protector, but a film screen protector, you should definitely go with the Rinke Duo Easy Film. Okay, this episode is not sponsored by Rinke at all. I purchased it with my own money. So I can give you my honest opinion and this screen protector is awesome. Okay, so thanks guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.